But some good football matches this weekend. Still to come today, we've got Blackburn and Burnley in Barcelona against Alaves. Uh, Wednesday at 7.30, live. Lake Orient play North, which Victoria looking further ahead in the week. Um, that's the second round FA Cup replay between the two, 7.30. And a super Sunday for us today at Old Trafford. And all you have to say is that it features Manchester United and Liverpool. I'm sure if you're a Liverpool fan, you're tired of hearing this, but Manchester United unbeaten in eight now, and they've won five of those. Liverpool have won only two of the 16 Premiership matches. Uh, their last win, December 95, 2-0 at Anfield. Manchester United unbeaten in ten here, although Liverpool have drawn six of those. They have won only one of the last 18, mind. March 90, 2-1, John Barnes with a couple. Uh, just looking outside, Steve, listening to what's happening outside. It, it, it's unusually, I, I know it'll be jumping when we start, but it's unusually quiet. There's a strange atmosphere about the place at this stage, isn't there? You always find that in the morning kickoffs, you know, it's a little bit subdued. That's what I always found that, you know, and it, and it is at the moment, certainly, I think, in the next, uh, when, the, when the teams come out, the atmosphere will pick up. I've never known Kenny so uh, uh, nervous about, about a game. Uh, is that the way you see it, Andy, from Liverpool's point of view? That they've lost three of the last four in the league and of course they would be going on about their poor record here at Old Trafford. Uh, possibly Martin but I, th I would actually think the other way around that if you were a player and you'd lost three okay man people will say supporters will probably think we're going to a ground where we've got a hopeless recent record um, they're the champions they're beating us all over the place at the moment what a great time to go and get a victory what a great time for the Liverpool players to come out and actually prove a point today and if you don't want to play in an arena like this with an atmosphere that's building up like this then you shouldn't be playing this sport so I actually think the Liverpool players in the dressing room might, should be should be relishing what awaits them Rivalry We'll shout at Goon to Prada Lam What a What a goal there's only one team in North London. Who rules in North London with Tottenham unbeatable at home? And Arsenal challenging for the title. Henry. What a goal! Both teams are ready to stake their claim. Come on, you Spurs. Come on, Arsenal. Fourth Monday Night Football, Tottenham v Arsenal tomorrow at 7, live on Sky Sports 1 and Sky Sports Extra. It's time then for Manchester United against Liverpool. A Sky Sports production available in widescreen, Dolby surround sound, and of course it's interactive for Sky digital viewers. All the usual features, stats, highlights, full screen camera angles, player cam and fan zone new for this season. Ian Trainer is our Manchester United fan today. Paul Hunter representing Liverpool. That's for Sky digital viewers on Channel 404. Let's join our match commentators, Andy Gray and Martin Tyler. So, no Cole. No York, no Sheringham. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer undoubtedly knew his name was going to be on this Manchester United team sheet. A boyhood Liverpool fan back in his native Norway. He's certainly shown no charity to the team from Anfield since he's come here to Manchester United. That FA Cup winning goal, you'll recall, equaliser here in this fixture as recently as last March. Liverpool to kick off. They're not alone in this, but they're striving to break a, a near monopoly by Manchester United, just as United were the ones to break Liverpool's own stranglehold on success in the 1970s and 80s. It's been a, a foggy morning in Manchester. Well, well, game on, as they say. Kenny Dalglish and Steve Bruce are with us today. We'll get their thoughts when they come back. Liverpool lead at Old Trafford. It's 1-0 at half-time. Dreams this Christmas on Sky Sports. 
football coming at us every which way at the moment. Tomorrow night, delighted to say Monday night football and that's some game too. Tottenham play Arsenal. Seven o'clock we start, that's on one and interactive for Sky Digital viewers on Sky Sports Extra. So what have we got here? Liverpool in front at half time. Manchester United not firing. Not allowed to fire, find out in a moment. Also seen one clearance off the line from Emil Heskey. Liverpool who have sat frustrated for the most part, have grabbed themselves a lead. Kenny Dalglish and Steve Bruce are with us. What have we got here then for Manchester United, Steve? Well, they've found it very, very difficult. I mean, to be fair, Liverpool have come with a game plan and, uh, and drop off and go back into their half. And it's very, very difficult for Man United to pass through them. Um, I think Gerard has been uh, magnificent in the first half. And they've found it really difficult to, to, to miss that cutting edge, you know. That's where you need to we'll talk about the strikers they're missing, um, certainly in the first half. And closer. Ipswich, then Fulham, and then Manchester United, in. That's a great free kick. Uh, you see Danny he hit the bar against Ipswich last week, hit the post against Fulham in midweek. He's curled that in. But Gary Neville and Irwin are on the... As you look at that, the right-hand side of the wall, two over. I don't know why they're standing there. There's, there's, there's not a Liverpool player that side, look. The two people, there, he goes to move out. I mean, he's never going to bend it past the outside of the wall here with your right foot into the net. And the goalkeepers gave him a good bit to hit. But to give Danny tremendous credit, he's been playing very well for Liverpool recently and he's he picked the spot. Just United have got some sorting out to do. 1-0 Liverpool. They love this one in Lancashire. It's been a while since it's played as well, but it's on again this afternoon. Burnley play Blackburn, 3 o'clock, Sky Sports 2, and it's interactive for Sky Digital viewers. Channel 404. Dundee United meet Rangers tonight at 6 on 1. If Rangers keep winning, they'll close the gap to 7 points before the mid-season break in Scotland. Valencia meet Malaga tonight, 6.30 on 3. Danny Murphy's goal that separates the team. Coming up then, the second half of Manchester United against Liverpool. A Sky Sports production available in widescreen, Dolby surround sound, and it's interactive, of course. That's Sky Digit viewers on channel 404. Our match commentators here today, Andy Gray and Martin Tyler. Ninth season of the Premiership. Manchester United have lost here only nine times in that period. Liverpool not on that roll of honour. Their last victory at Old Trafford in the old Division 1, March 1990. That was also the last season they won the championship. In the interim, they've had some uh, promising situations in this fixture, as they have today. Well, you and I have certainly seen them take the lead off and off here, Martin, over these last nine years. Even in the, the FA Cup, was it last year? One up with, what, four or five minutes to go? Ended up losing it. Yeah, charges it down fairly enough. Again, the message will be from Phil Thompson and Jared Houllier. Keep the ball if you can. Run down the clock. We're dealing in seconds. Well, they are. And I tell you, if you do see it out, Mark, the back four, in particular for Liverpool today, have been absolutely immense. They could not have given the goalkeeper better protection. It's been built on those four. I'll tell you that now. Every one of them. They've won it. Gerard Houllier said we will beat Manchester United one day, this is that day. Huge results and there's another huge day of live sports still to come. It's cricket on Sky Sports, one of half past two action from the one day international between South Africa and Sri Lanka. It's followed at six by live Scottish football, Dundee United against Rangers. Coming up on two at three o'clock, there's first division football, Burnley against Blackburn and at seven, it's Moscone Cup Pool, the second session of the day as Europe take on the United States. You can catch the first live session over on Sky Sports 3 next. And there's live Spanish football at half past six, live American football at nine. And for Sky Digital viewers, coming up on Sky Sports Extra, there's interactive coverage of Burnley against Blackburn at three and live international cricket, the Aussies against the West Indies tonight from 12.30.
Football beyond your wildest dreams this Christmas on Sky Sports. 